God took care of us. We were very lucky. A Clio, Michigan couple just miles from the horrors unfolding in France shares their story exclusively tonight on Fox 66 News at 10. It was a trip they planned back in May, a chance to see France for the very first time. But when Kirk and Marie Heath began their weekend trip, they could have never predicted how their pictures would change or the story their lens would tell. These are their images and this is their story. You'll only see it on Fox 66 News. The images came alive for Marie and Kirk Heath. You read about these things, but you never dreamed you'd be there. But there it was, the Eiffel Tower, Paris, France, Champs Elysees, a boat ride on the Seine, and then back on the bus for a night lights tour two days into their four day adventure. We noticed that there were just all sorts of police cars. And I was sitting right here at my desk when I heard about the attacks. I had just done a story with Marie, knew she was in Paris. She'd sent me this picture, so I text her to see if she was okay. I think I text you right back. What is going on? The tour had stopped early without telling them why. At that point, they walked home in the dark. It was almost surreal, though, because there were all sorts of people still out on the streets. Dropped off just two miles from events unfolding at the Bataclan Theater. So it was... Uh, Pretty unnerving. When they returned to their hotel. I think that's when it really kind of settled into us so how scary it was. Marie took this video of the quiet in the hours that followed, waiting in their hotel. It's just sad that those families will be torn apart forever now. As the sun rose, 129 lives lost, hundreds injured, and the streets changed, the crowds gone. That is always concerning when you see folks with, with rifles on, on a sidewalk. Images they cannot forget, just like the people who died in six separate terror attacks. You would hope that they don't die in vain. Exactly. The trip home to Clio. Just relief. Meaning everything to the Heaths. God took care of us. We were very lucky. Safe at home. Dave, certainly a difficult experience for the Heath, but I think when these things happen, you realize how much you're loved, and they said they were just touched by how many people reached out to them, texted them, and checked on them. Now, are they afraid to go back, or do they want to go back? What are they saying about that? You know, the main goal um, for Kirk was to go to Normandy, and of course that was Saturday, and that didn't end up happening. He says, no, we're going to go back. We're not going to let the terrorists win, and we will travel. So they're determined. Uh, good story, Sadie. All right, thanks, Thank Dave. You.